What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Black Walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we actually defeated Skyla for our sixth badge. And then we had a, a somewhat of an awkward encounter with, uh, with N. Talking about something about liberation of Pokemon, being a friend of uh, certain legendary Pokemon and all that crud. He he he, he kind of has a little bit of a something going up in in, in this in the head there. I don't know. See, he's insane in the membrane. So, uh, let's see. First, let's go ahead and go in here. I think there's somebody who wants to give us something. So after defeating the gym leader, this guy right here is like, "Wow, a jet badge! You won against Skylar. Okay, I'll tell you something cool. We left our treasure at the edge of our of the runway. What runway? The oh yeah yeah yeah. I already got that. Yeah, I already got that. Okay, never mind. Wow, that was uh, anticlimactic. So the next uh, adventure right here, we're gonna be going past uh, past uh, Route Seven right here. We gotta get to the uh, Twist Mountain, which I'm not looking forward to. Uh, let's see. Yes, we have to go right here. And uh, now, once you get over here, hold on just a sec. I have a feeling. I have. I feel the disturbance of the force. I did not heal my Pokemon. Good gravy. Okay, so good thing that we're in front of this house because they will actually heal your Pokemon right away. Now, by the way, Grillmonger kicked everybody's butt. Yes, sir. He kicked everybody's butt. Now, I think if you talk to this guy, uh, no, he won't talk to me about anything. But this place is of something of importance later on into this, uh, this walkthrough right here. He will be discussing something about a legendary Pokemon. Now, yeah, the cross transceiver is ringing. And uh, what do we got? Oh, it's Mama. Draven. This is your mom. How are you doing? Wow, you're already at Route 7? You've gone quite far! Say, how are your Pokémon? You can't get this far with, uh, all by yourself, you know? It's all thanks to your Pokémon. Don't forget to take care of them. Am I being too serious? Well, take care. Senior Trainer Mom, signing off. Oh, well, Mom's being... Mom? I guess. I don't know. That was kind of weird. I thought she was going to give us something awesome or something. Alright, so we're going to be continuing our, our adventure right here, and, uh, oh wow, there's going to be some Harlequins right- oh god, dang it. Okay, so I'm going to get the items, and then, battle the Harlequins, as you can see, TM81, x Scissor. It's a very good move. And, uh, well, I guess it's time to battle some trainers. It's only good for us, so let's go ahead and, uh, get Shedder up to level 40 right here, that way, we can continue, uh, you know, kicking everybody's butt. So let's go right ahead and uh, talk to this guy right here. We're gonna have a battle up here in the balance beam. A battle on a raised walkway. That's kind of cool. Kind of is. It really is. Kind of is. I don't even know. Okay, so here we go. Harlequin Pat. He's coming with oh crud in Emolga, a Pokemon that I've, uh, I've said on quite a few occasions that I kind of, I kind of, I kind of don't like because. Kind of a tricky Pokemon. So let's go back to the hero of the last episode, Drillmonger, and uh, let's go ahead and kick some butt right now. So there we go. Drillmonger, let's go. And uh, there's that acrobatics move that he <laughs> kind of screwed up in the last episode. And yes, I do have the Rocky Helmet. So your attacks will have a uh, will have consequences. And here we go. Rock Slide takes care of that. Say goodbye to Emolga. Alrighty, alrighty, and he's coming out with the sickle lift. Screw it, let's do it. Let's go right ahead and uh, just do the rock type moves right here. Now, eh, we're, what, I, I think this is episode 30. Yes, it is episode 30. So, and, you know, after we got six badges in 30 episodes, that's probably a nice record right there, guys, because normally I like to take, uh, I like to take these walkers piece for piece and all that crud. And, uh, well, I'm being very, very serious with the whole, uh, the whole thing about me trying to finishing or trying to finish this whole walkthrough ahead of schedule because, uh, you know, kind of, I kind of, I am kind of notorious for uh, for taking long on walkthroughs. Uh, Pokemon Planet was a a different, well, was kind of a was kind of a separate occasion because I did not know that I can actually use my desktop for for Nintendo DS games. That's why it was not a live com at all. And uh, well, right here, now that this is now that Nintendo DS games are live or live and live com and all that stuff, well, they're gonna be they're gonna be finished a lot quicker and all that crud. The other thing too, COVID nineteen. Yeah, 
COVID freaking 19 now. I hope, I am hoping by the time, I don't know, like maybe two years from now, as I look back, look back onto this walker right here, we can all laugh at uh, what went on with the COVID-19. As many of you guys already know, the world right now, uh, it is April 18th, it's technically stopped. Everybody's doing social distancing. Everybody has to stay in, in the house because, uh, you know, COVID-19 and all that crud. I hope we can look back on it and just laugh on like how isolated we were. How freaking isolated and how much time Draven had to actually create all these uh, this content right here. I hope we can do that. And another thing that I'm hoping for is that you guys are safe and none of your loved ones have been affected or anything like that. As I'm probably, uh, as you guys already know, I'm, I have yet to be affected. I'm not essential as a worker. A personal trainer cannot be doing stuff because, yeah, cesspool of, uh, of germs in a gym. But, I'm doing okay guys. Everything's fine. If it does sound like I'm a little tired or anything like that, it's mainly because uh, those, those separate nights that I had, uh, making these walkthrough videos, they were all nighters uh, for Pokemon Liquid Crystal, Omega Ruby, Black. Yeah, all nighters just to get at least 30 to 40 episodes out, or record 30 to 40 episodes. That way, when we get out of this whole pandemic thing, you know, we can, uh, you know, I, I can just upload these videos without without any problem or anything like that. So here we are in Twist Mountain, and uh, well, let's see. I have a feeling that we're gonna get attacked here somewhere. Yes, we are. Look at this guy, Draven. Since we both hold the jet badge now, let's see which one of us is stronger. Well, obviously it's me. It's gonna be me. Here we go again, another battle against our rival Sharon, and he, of course, is coming out with his unpheasant right here. Now, do I have the right Pokemon for this one? Yes, I do. Okay, so let's go with Gigalift right here. We got the move for this guy right here. Let's go. Charge beam. Let, oh, crud. It, he avoided the move. And I might not be able to use that move. Good god. No, never mind. Here we go. God dang it. So, so far, I'm not doing so hot. Here we go. Charge beam. Let's get it. Finish this guy off. And it increases his attack, or special attack, just a little. But we gotta be careful for this air slash attack because, well, it's high on critical. And, uh, let's get this. Side beam, come on. Finish him. Yeah, buddy. And there goes Unpheasant. Oh, yeah. Okay, alright. My Pokemon are doing well. And the taunt is off. And now he's gonna be coming out with the Light Perch. So let's go. Well, let's take it up right here. Let's go with Shedder. Shadar. Shedder. Shattered the cheese or something like that. I don't know. And uh, look at that light bird looking menacing and all that crap. So here we go. High jump kick and crap baskets. You gotta love that. You gotta love the flinching. Well, let's go again. High jump kick and god dang it. What is it with these Pokemon in torment? All right, here we go. High jump kick for the win. Suck it, light bird. Suck it. Okay, and look at that. Side of the torrent grows a little 41. And here he comes out with the Servine. Finally, okay, let's go with our secret weapon. Not so secret, but secret weapon right here. And that is our good old buddy Hotshot. Look at this guy. All right, Servine. Okay, here we go. Let's finish him off with Style Flare Blitz. Yeah, buddy. I thought you were gonna evolve. Not really. And Servine, easily defeated just like that. Look at that. I don't mind the HP loss and all that crud. And here he comes out with a semi port, so I gotta go with the Pokemon that can invade that. So let's go with our good old buddy, Stoutland from Scotland. Oh, you guys already know him by Ace. That's a good doggy right there. Look at that. It's a good doggy. I wish it was real. I wish I still had my Stoutland. Alright, here we go. Let's get this takedown. And oh crud, Scald attack. Remember the last time this guy got hit with Scald? With scald? pretty bad and uh, yeah he got burned so that kind of minimizes my attack a little and uh, okay so oh crud getting done getting done right there so let's go with the crunch come on crap baskets didn't know scald with that was that strong oh god okay you're gonna pay for that you're definitely gonna pay for that so let's go sigh of the torrent I do have the move for this guy alrighty 
Let's go. Grass Knot. How are you faster than my Pokemon? Asshole you. And crap, I'm not getting burnt. Getting freaking burnt right here. Alrighty, Simicor, get your ass out of here. That's right. And look at that, Shetran is defeated. Pokemon battles are fun. But why do you have, why does he always have to lose? Hmm. That was a fine Pokemon battle! I'm happy to see you are both uh, growing as trainers. Huh? Oh wow, it's the show off right here. It's Super Saiyan Brawly himself. Look at this guy. If it isn't the champion Alder, I'm weak, so I lost. And honestly, it bothers me when you call it a fine battle despite that. Oh, honestly, Charon. Just accept the compliment, compliment without the stinging remark. I've asked you this before, but what do you plan on doing after becoming strong? If I get strong and become the champion, that will be the reason for my existence. Oh wow, this guy has nothing to do. Okay, so I want to prove that I am uh, really living. Oh wow. Hmm. You remind me of Marshall. Of course, having something you want to become uh, is so important. But what, it, what is even more important is uh, what you do with your newfound power. Anyways, take this. Oh, what is he giving us? Here, you two. And look at that. Throwing out the peace sign, guys. We get the HMO3 Surf. Yeah, buddy. Okay, if you put, if you use the Surf, uh, if you use the move Surf, you can uh, travel over the water. I shall see you again, young trainers. Don't forget about the the needs of your Pokemon and your at your side. Okay, that's cool. That's a good guy right there. That's good. What I do with my power? I don't know what uh, what the answer, or I don't know that answer yet. First, I want to become strong, uh, strong trainer, so everyone will acknowledge my, that power. I'm not going to acknowledge you, Draven. Next time, I will win. Yeah, sure. Flipping you off, buddy. Flipping you off. Okay, so let's see. I, assuming he wants the battle, maybe. I don't know. All right, let's 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 heal up our Pokemon first. Uh, Sharon kind of did a number on me. Kind of pissed off about that. Uh, let's see, where is a... Ah, uh, here we go. Burn heal. Let's use that. Get a hyper potion going. And... I'm assuming this guy might have rock type Pokemon, so let's go right in and put uh, Sigh of the Torrent right here. And... Let's see what this guy does. Yes, he wants the battle. Okay. What you want? Conquering a mountain means conquering your fears. Can you win against Pokemon that have conquered many mountains? Maybe. I don't know. We shall find out right here on Dragon Ball Z. So here we go. Terrell Owens wants the battle, and he's coming out with Bulldore. Probably should have taught Sai of the Torrent, sir. I probably should have. But I didn't. So let's go with Razor Shell right here. Let's get this. Razor Shell does it, and here's that sturdy technique that Boulder has. Good God. There we go. Oh, crud. Here we go. Okay, so here we go again. Let's get this Razor Shell for the win. It's kind of funny, but that Boulder looks like an anus right there. I had to say it, guys. You guys were thinking it. And he's coming out with a girder, so let's go. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Yes, let's go with Gigalith right here, since... It is a psychic type Pokemon and a flying type. I just don't know if it's gonna survive. I don't know. We will find out. All right, you big old veiny bastard with a freaking girder. Literally a girder on your hands. Here we go with the Psybeam, and yes, sir, takes him out. Yeah, buddy. That's right. And look at that. Gigalith finally grows to level 35. 100 HP, by the way. Look at that. Okay. All righty. Okay, guys, so we're going to stop our episode right here. Now that we got the Surf Technique, and now that we got the Jet Badge, we are enabled to actually surf wherever we want. So in the next episode, I'm going to I'm going to surf to areas that we, we could surf at, grab a few items. Hell, we might even encounter a legendary Pokemon while we're at it. So we're going to take a side quest before we get to Isra City. Hopefully... Hopefully we make it to Istra City before the snow ends. Don't know when that when, so comment down below and let me know the timing of the seasonings and all that stuff too. So thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys next time.